It's a place where you can dine on jambalaya and listen to live blues music, but you don't have to go to New Orleans to find it. Elmer Dills takes us to Long Beach in a restaurant that also features Italian cuisine and fresh seafood. He's Phil Traney, the owner of the Chef of Traney's in Long Beach, an area I've neglected lately. He's a hands-on chef and, unlike many chefs today, rarely leaves the stove to mingle with the guests. The restaurant has a comfortable feeling, a fairly low noise level, tables and booths not too close together. Service helpful. The staff, they work hard to please the guests. Not always the case in many places these days. Trini's menu is extensive with the focus on Italian and fresh seafood specialties. Look it over, but hey, I've got a better idea. Every day there's a dozen or so specials on the blackboard. Now this is where I suggest ordering from. Jambalaya with scallops and shrimp and homemade spicy sausage and chicken is great. Fresh Hawaiian ahi pepper steak with bacon shallots and a cooked pepper sauce. A New York steak with a gorgonzola cheese sauce. Unusual and unusually good. Just some of the daily blackboard specials at moderate prices. Good news. Wednesday through Saturday, there's live blues, jazz music and a separate lounge by some very talented musicians. That's a plus. The bad news? This is where the smokers congregate, so stay away if you're not interested in breathing secondhand smoke. My bottom line, a pleasant experience, a dedicated, hard-working chef, a friendly, helpful staff, an interesting selection of dishes. Phil Traney's Restaurant, 3390 East Long Beach Boulevard in Long Beach, 310-426-3668. Lunch Monday through Friday, dinner every night. In the weeks ahead, I'll have some more interesting and unusual restaurants in the Long Beach area, and that is a promise. Now for Dills Channel 7 Eyewitness News from Long Beach. That's Eyewitness News at 5 for Lisa McCree, Harold Green, Johnny Mountain, Dallas Rain.